Yesterday, we got results from the Department of Justice's Inspector General report into the origins of the Russia investigation. And despite Trump's conspiracy theories, to the contrary, the IG found that the FBI was justified in opening its investigation into ties between the Trump campaign and Russia and did not act with political bias. Good news for the FBI and the country. Now the FBI can get back to their important work, thrilling you every Tuesday at 9, 8 central, <laughs> only CBS. <laughs> Synergy. You dig? You dig? I'm not the only one glad this investigation of the investigation came up clean. So is FBI director and guy hoping no one notices he forgot his trumpet, <laughs> Christopher Ray. Ray praised the IG report with as much enthusiasm as you'd expect from an FBI director. And I think uh, it's important that the inspector general found that in this particular instance, the investigation was opened with appropriate predication and authorization. Okay, appropriate predication and authorization. Nothing for Trump to be upset about, right? Wrong. I don't know what report current director of the FBI, Christopher Wray, was reading, but it sure wasn't the one given to me. Oh, nothing says job security like calling someone the current director of the FBI. <laughs> yes, that's like saying... <laughs> Ominous. That's like saying, why is my current wife so suspicious about all my business trips? I mean, my next wife is totally cool with it. <laughs> Trump isn't the only one casting doubt on the IG's findings, so is Attorney General and saddest decorative gourd, <laughs> William Barr. Barr went on the TV today to express his disappointment that the Inspector General found his own department had sufficient cause to start the investigation. One area I do disagree uh, with the IG, and that was whether there was sufficient predication to open a full-blown uh, uh, counterintelligence investigation. That's the Trump administration for you. We didn't do anything wrong? That does not sound like us. <laughs> now, Trump and Barr are all in on the deep state conspiracy, and so is their friend, the puppeteered carcass of Lou Dobbs. The Department of Justice Inspector General Michael Horowitz declared he was unable to find any political bias behind the surveillance of the 2016 Trump campaign. All this, more evidence of the radical Dems and the deep state's awesome control of our permanent bureaucracy of our federal government. Listen! There is no proof there's a deep state conspiracy. That just proves there is a deep state conspiracy because the, only the deep state could have hidden the proof. <laughs> we got a great show for you tonight. Ed Harris.